What's going on guys? Welcome to the Final Fantasy Grave Extra Studio, and we're finally going to be testing out Hurley. So my Hurley here, base form doesn't matter. Grave Shield form is all that matters right now. So we have 100% low burst damage with these two things. This material basically is a better version of Luna Freya's. The 5 star version of Death's Team Arts is better, basically a better version of that on CN. This is a CN version of an S team or and 60% magic, I think, and some other things. And this is about best and slide as best and slide as I can get. Um overshotting the evil magic and evil damage. And then 280% low burst damage, which is okay. 200% true to wield for magic. And uh that's about it. So let's try and one shot some stuff. So the first one's really funny. <laughs> oh my god, this is this is funny every time I do it. It just is so satisfying. You're gonna see. You're gonna see, guys. It's just bam, dead. <laughs> uh, it's pretty funny. It's just ridiculous and power, not a power creep. This, this. I'm not even feeling bad about this trial here because this trial used to be like the hard. I used to feel like this was like the hardest trial in the game back then. So I don't feel bad at all. I do not feel bad about that. I'm about doing that. So. Yep. Anyways, let's us imbue. She does have enhancements, but this one doesn't have it, unfortunately. So she does have enhancements. So let's go ahead and kill off the main one here. Uh, it's gonna be a little more tanky, but still not a big deal. As you can see, <laughs> oh my god, this is so funny, dude. That is just so funny. You guys have no idea. That is just extremely funny, dude. Alright. Oh, I didn't expect that. I did not expect that to happen. I just used her regular abilities and they just destroyed all of them. I wasn't even chaining. I was just pausing to get rid of- I was, I was ready to do some damage and then bam. Just one of her abilities just killed all of them. By herself. That's insane. Well, I wasn't expecting that and uh, it doesn't obviously affect any of our missions here, so... <laughs> that's one trial down. <laughs> one trial down, guys. Alright, let's keep going. Hey guys, we're back yet again for another trial. We're going to do the Mad Doll. Keep in mind guys, yes, I'm using a bunch of new vision units, but I have almost no killers. And yeah, she doesn't need any killers, but we're going to we're going to try and one-shot the final one, which I think is possible even with seven stars, I think. But keep in mind guys, again, that I'm a new player. I haven't, I haven't even beaten this trial yet, so even if I haven't beaten it, um, don't criticize me in the comments for it. So I'm not really going to show gear too much because I, mean, I don't really have a lot of good gear. I guess that's why I'm doing these trials. And a shelf Hurley, so let's get into it. So I guess I'll just do this. We're not going to be using Hurley for this section because her Lunar Burst is only a single target, so not really a point in doing that too much. But we're going to go ahead and use the 85%. Hopefully it's AoE. Yeah. AoE, AoE full break here. And so we're going to go ahead and Chain these down, hopefully they die pretty quickly here. Um, they should. They're fully broken. 85% defense break, they should melt. Or maybe not. Apparently just call Hurley. Call Hurley and she'll just do everything for you. I have no idea why that does so much damage. In fact, I'm just going to, we're going to find out. This is a 50 times mod and gives her some stat buffs and things like that. And then I use this, which I guess is a stack. I guess this is strong. The 100 times mod. I guess that's the reason why they are getting wrecked because it's like a 100 times mod. So this shouldn't be too bad. I almost, I almost accidentally clicked on the, uh, on him. For that situation. 
Now he's broken. She, he, whatever, it's a doll, it doesn't matter. And this should be like an easy. And this should be pretty easy. <laughs> yes. Oh my god, it's so satisfying. Just the bam, instant zero percent. It's just so satisfying, guys. You guys have no idea how satisfying that is. It's just, it's insane how. It's just, it's just so. It just feels really nice. Don't give me any, you know what, in the comments for saying, oh, that's just, you know, it's, the, it's just the doll trial, it's nothing special. It's still satisfying to see as a new player clearing this stuff. I leveled up on accident. I didn't mean to level up, but okay, fine. I guess I'll have to go take care of that. Uh, there's a raid in some point. That's nice to get though, that that uh, doll there. Very nice to get as a, as a free-to-play player and not have much stuff. Uh, it won't really benefit her too much because she has basically wants to have those two things that I have there uh, in my in my equipment there. So, but it'll help out Terra, for example, and stuff like that. Anyways, we're gonna get into the one more trial here, and I'll see how that goes. All right, here we are in the last fight here. We're gonna be doing Scorner Shinryu. We're gonna start in her base form, um, just for the fist and peril and the lightning and peril and stuff like that. So with that being said, let us get into it. So we're good from the cover aspect of things, as we should. First of all, white cast, fist and peril, this ability, this on herself for a lone first fill, I guess, but it doesn't really matter that much. And also the Thunder and Peril. On is going to go ahead and use the perfect dispel, Mirage for everybody, and a break. We're going to use all these things here. And we're going to go ahead and Ice and Dew, Dragon Killer that move thing, whatever it is. <laughs> some stuff here, some protections. And Gibranth is gonna go ahead and use some mitigations. Why not, right? Yeah. And then we're gonna go ahead and this chain. I mean, it's not going to do a lot of damage, but we're not looking at it doing a lot of damage here. We're just, this is prep turn. And hopefully we can survive the next turn, huh? Poor Von. Did not survive. The Fist and Peril, although it's kind of bugged right now. This is the Fist and Peril. And Lightning in Peril. So we're gonna go ahead and summon. And these three things. We don't need to see that effect. As nice as it maybe is. And there's the one shot. There it is, guys. And just cover. Uh, is this no? This time no fire resistance, but we should be fine. I mean, there's no way we'll die because we're gonna cover and auto raise, anyways. Well, not a big deal. Alright, well there's that, guys. <laughs> oh, it's just so satisfying uh, to beat these trials. Uh, we'll have to try to do a, a little harder on the other ones, though. The other ones are going to take some more effort. And obviously we can't do a TM at because it absorbs lightning, so that's a party pooper. And we'll use our base form. All missions though, guys, this is really good to get all this equipment, that's for sure. 
All right, that's going to be the end of the video, guys. Very strong unit, as you can see right there. Fists in peril, 35%, really high. All those other things, really high, really insane, really powerful. And maybe in the next video, we can work on her base form. But her base form is just basically a, a typical um, chainer. Obviously, the attraction is her brave shift form, which is way more lucrative. But she has so many other things she can do. So, yep. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you leave a like on the video, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye!